Hi there, it's Jim from Janku. Today I want to take a look at updating our Go version. So currently I have version 1.12 on my computer and there was a recent version of Go release. So if I go over to the website and we go to golang.org and then we click on download Go and I'm using Linux so I'm going to click on this. So you'll notice here it's downloading Go 1.14. So I can say OK here. So I'll extract this folder to my downloads and I'll press extract and then I'll show those files and you can see I have go here now and you can see the structure of this if you want to look inside of it now if I were to go back to my terminal here inside of VS Codium and let me just expand this so we can see it a little better if I were to say which go you'll notice that I'm currently using the go version inside user local so basically I could come in here and I could move this go folder into that location in user local and then use the newer version of Go that way. Before I get started with that, I'm actually going to come in here and I'm going to move the older version to my desktop just in case I want to refer back to it for any reason. So I'll come in here, I'll move this whole folder over to my desktop. And it says permission denied here, so I actually have to come in here and I have to run this as a super user. So I'll run sudo. So it's saying there's already a Go folder on my desktop. Let's take a look here. So this is because we already moved some of the stuff to the desktop. So let's just remove this. I'm going to click, move this to the trash. And then let's go and try to run that one more time. Okay, so we've moved that to the desktop. And so now let's do another move, except this time, let's move the Go folder from our downloads into this user local folder here. So I'm gonna come in here and I'm going to say, downloads go and we'll press enter and now if we say go version you can see that we have the newer version of go here we now have 1.14 installed now another thing you're going to have to do if you haven't already set up go in the past is you actually have to come in here and you'd have to set up your bash rc to make sure that Go is in your path. So here's how I'm adding Go to my path. So I'm adding the user local Go bin here. So make sure you have a line that's similar to this. So we should be good to use the newer version of Go now. Hopefully this was helpful for you if you're using an Ubuntu computer. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more Go tutorials in the near future. Thanks, bye.